Hello, Pastor Keith Hodges, and I want to welcome you today to our 3-Minute Leadership Broadcast. And today I want to talk to you about what we're going to call the people problem. Uh, the reality is, is that as a leader, uh, you are constantly and consistently solving problems. And I heard it said one time that when we die, the two things we'll be remembered for are the problems that we solve and the problems that we create. And hopefully we're going to solve a whole lot more than we create in our lifetime. But the reality is, is that every day as a pastor or a ministry leader, you are constantly confronted with problems, right? People are coming to you, they're sharing relational problems, spiritual problems, financial problems, and even vocational problems on their job. And the challenge is simply this, if we're not careful, if we're not careful, we will actually begin to look at people like they are problems that need to be solved. And we'll begin to look at people like they're problems that need to be solved instead of looking at people and realizing that people aren't problems that need to be solved. People are people that need to be ministered to. People are people that need to be loved and encouraged and comforted and counseled and prayed with and strengthened by the Holy Spirit to get them through the process that God has for them. In 1 Peter chapter 4, verse 10, the Bible says this, as each one has received a gift, minister it to one another as good stewards of the manifold grace of God. So our job is not to fix people. That's God's job, right? Only God can save people. Only God can heal people, deliver people, redeem people, rescue people. Our job is to minister to people. And I want to challenge you to think about that in your daily interaction with people. Don't let people ever become the problem. Don't ever look at people like they're a problem that needs to be fixed. Make sure you keep your people perspective clear and recognize that the people that are in your life, the people that are in your church, the people that are on your team are not problems that need to be fixed. They are people that need to be ministered to. And that as ministers of the gospel, we have the hope of Jesus Christ, we have the power of the word, and we have the wonderful ministry of prayer and comfort that only God can bring by the Holy Spirit. And so I want to encourage you today, recognize you are a minister of the gospel. And the greatest opportunity we have every day is to minister as ministers the love and the truth of Jesus Christ. The people problem is that people are never a problem. They are people that need to be ministered to. God bless you today in Jesus' name.